All right, so the audio issue that I had with Shadow previously has been fixed, and you're probably wondering, well, how did I fix that issue? One simple, one simple way. Uh, you have to download the GeForce Experience app, and you have to keep up the uh, RTX P5000 Quattro graphics card up to date. Uh, that's why there was no audio because of the graphics drivers that were missing. There are required for you to have the audio uh, synced in properly. So as you can see here, I am on a shadow. This is shadow. The quality is uh, fairly nice. There it is right there. Uh, this, mo uh, this laptop, it's 144 hertz. So it already has 144 hertz display. Uh, so obviously it's going to run it at 1080p, 144 uh, hertz, which is right over there with the adaptive sync. Um, well, the good thing about the shadow is it will recognize the monitor. If your monitor supports 144 hertz, it will adapt to that 144 hertz. If your monitor supports... Uh, ultra wide screen it will present resolution in that ultra wide screen native uh, 144 Hertz refresh rate uh, and you, you can also use a, a dual monitor with shadow that's another thing you can do as well so that's pretty much all you had to do to get the uh, to get the sound working and here I'm gonna show you how well the sound is we're going to zoom in a little bit on the F18. Everything's running in ultra settings. This looks pretty good, actually. There we go. Nice and smooth. I believe we're somewhere in Maine, somewhere out there in Maine, I believe. These are the ultra settings, uh, 1080p, 144 hertz. Let's use the afterburners. Let's uh, zoom out a little bit. This is actually uh, F-18 from uh, Top Gun Maverick uh, in the upcoming movie. So if you're looking for a uh, U.S. Navy... F-18 Hornet C. I think Bill says E or C. I'm, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it's a it's a E, right? This is a E, not a C. Uh, that's, but that's the one that I believe uh, it's being used in the movie. The movie's coming out next month, May 27th, just in time for um, Memorial Day. Let's uh, go ahead and uh, switch to a cockpit view. Pretty good detail. Um, now, you guys have to remember, I am uh, using a wired Ethernet for my modem uh, to get this uh, smooth quality, which is right over here. There you go. You see that Ethernet port, that Ethernet cable that goes right over here to my router, which is right over here. Um, and I believe I forgot to use the uh, de-icing. Forgot to turn that on.
we are running everything at the ultra settings looks pretty darn good not bad for a shadow you know running this game in ultra settings even at 1080p uh, can be a bit of a stretch believe it or not this is a very highly demanding uh, CPU and GPU type of a game even though um, you know internet is also very important for uh, photogemetry let's uh, zoom in a little bit see it see how it looks oh, well, that looks pretty darn good so uh, I also want to do a bunch of tests uh, I was talking to my friend Cameron earlier uh, today or last night I'm sorry and um, I uh, want to use the PlayStation now app with shadow I was telling Cameron that I would like to use their fiber optic uh, one gigabit one gigabit up down one gigabit up and down upload and download fiber optic super speed internet that they have from shadow to uh, run PlayStation now games and uh, I just want to see how stable it is I also want to uh, use uh, stadia with shadow I want to test that I also want to test uh, you know Amazon Luna with with shadow why because I want to use their internet why should I use mine when I can use theirs uh, to see how well it performs so there's that benefit uh, something uh, it just dawned on me I was thinking about that when I was talking to my friend Cameron um, like I should definitely use their internet why not and even with this game you can see that the photogemetry it's looking really good because um, we are using we are using their uh, internet we're not using our internet we're using theirs to render uh, the photogemetry and all that jazz and it looks pretty good actually uh, this is ultra settings if you don't believe me here I'll I'll, I'll prove it to you because you know these days you know especially with the internet you gotta prove everything otherwise it's just a hearsay uh, as you can see right here everything set to ultra 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 as you can see ultra as as ultra as it can be as ultra as it can be so I just wanted to showcase that and the end results you know pretty darn good so the audio has been fixed so that's the only problem that's the only issue is the um, uh, you have to update your graphics drivers and that's something I forgot to do because the reason this happens it's when they give you a PC when they activate the PC you have to pretty much update everything yourself it's like getting a brand new PC you know you gotta get the latest drivers uh, Windows updates etc 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 so you have to pretty much do everything that you would normally do on a um, on your own PC when you buy it when you, when you take it out of the box and you boot it up and all of that so uh, now it's working just fine no issues no problems and uh, well, there you have it. Just a short little video. I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Take care.